Welcome back to Nashville, everyone. Finally tonight, many a young musician has traveled to Nashville with a few dollars in their pocket, a guitar in hand, and dreams of standing on this very stage at the Ryman Auditorium. After all, stars from Elvis to Johnny Cash to Duke Ellington played here. Music is the soul of this city, from Broadway to the back alleys and beyond. Now that's the mother church right there. And if these walls could talk, they'd probably sing an anthem to music history. This building has been and continues to be the gathering place of the city. The Ryman Auditorium was built in 1892 as a place of worship. Since then, it's evolved into the mother church of country music and much more. You name it, we've had it. Comedy, gospel, blues, rock and roll. Jazz greats and rock and roll legends performed here. Presidents attended events. And those who have taken this stage say there's no other experience quite like it. 1999, 2000 was the first time I ever walked out on that stage, and it, it's, you're hit with the gravity of it. In 1943, its most famous act arrived, the Grand Old Opry, the show's home until 1974. My coat of many colors now. Stars like Dolly Parton and Charlie Pride made their Opry debuts right here on this stage. Johnny Cash! Carried into living rooms, the Opry show became America's longest running radio program, helping cement Nashville's reputation as Music City. Oh, Where we're standing is the most historical stage in country music. Life. I met up with country music star Michael Ray. Do you remember the first time though you played in this auditorium? I do, yeah, you never forget it. You feel that energy from the men and women that made this room what it was back in the day. And then, grabbing our instruments, I got to experience my own Ryman moment. I started loving you yeah. yeah. All right, man. <laughs> that was great, Good stuff, man. Good Dang. stuff. And Michael is right, nothing like playing this stage. Thanks for watching our YouTube channel. Follow today's top stories and breaking news by downloading the NBC News app.